Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Hello, hello. Um, so for you, for the month of May, month of May is the energy of strength. Some of you could be dealing with Sagittarians or fire sign people, but it's more finding inner strength to deal with situations around you. So there is a lot that is going on in this month. Um, the energy, whenever the energy of strength comes up, it's all about you finding inner strength to cope and deal with situations that is going on around you. Okay, so inner strength is what is going to be happening for you guys. It's about really, really, really connecting in such a positive way in your life. So let's check out and see what's coming out for you. Kansas, please like, share these videos, cross watch, cross watch. This video is going to be an hour longer. Um, check out this video on um, on demand. Use the link below. Success, um, a new change of energy. Um, it's not really success. They're saying they're saying it's a new change of energy. It's as if something is about to change in your life. Okay, so whatever the situation is, it's about something is about to change in your life. Here is a transition that is coming in. So some of you could have been going through something, dealing with negative forces. It could be you yourself that has created a situation. And um, this definitely, 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 um, that this is going to be changing. Now, you guys have, in the middle of the month, the debt to your enemies. So some of you were really dealing with some unsavory people or situations in your lives and that in the second and third week is going to come to an end as we look at this energy we have fire coming in in the first week whatever you decide to do the first week and the last week of this month is going to be the best time to make any decision and make any changes in your life the first week on the last week as we look at this energy of the sun is that a situation is finally going to be ending and your spirit guides are letting you know that you have gone through such a horrible time and this is finally finally ending now the central of your week it's all about your uh, money it's all about how it's all about nurturing it's about your money it's about you building your life it's all about nurturing it's about the mother grandmother feelings that is coming up some of you are definitely dealing with a situation and you're going to be finding out that it could be at your work but it could be a situation with an organization that there were some people that was really working against you you're definitely going to be seeing the truth it could be a Pisces that is coming up and letting you be aware of whatever that was transpiring the energy of the magician is going to be coming in to help you especially with your business um, to open up um, doors for your business whatever is happening you cancers it's gonna be good You're ending this month in a very positive note. It is going to be absolutely fabulous for you guys. Work and business. Um, some of you could be receiving promotion um, or some of you, um, some good news is going to be coming in. Um, it can be in different forms for all of you because you're all um, working on different energy vibration. You're all cancers. But you're working on um, different energy vibration I'm seeing that some of you are really going to be reconnecting with people um, and you know it's as if the universe is sending you help that is coming in so what we're looking at in the first week is as if a new sort of a shift of energy a new shift of consciousness is going to be coming in it's not about success it's about um, a new shift of consciousness that is going to be coming in there is definitely an end to the blocks that was happening with you when because you were dealing with some really negative people and this could be coming out of an organization or it could be coming out from work now what is happening is that your spirit guides is making sure that you understand that you're going to be um, really 
coming out of this situation on top it's as if they want you to know that no matter what you're going through you are going to be resolving the situation on top there is a nurturing energy that is here to support you and what is happening is that um, they're saying look within to resolve a situation because you have all the pieces to resolve the situation and you're going to be very very successful doing that as we look at the third week really there you are going to be finding out that there was some blocks with your financial flow the materialistic world your life but this block um, is going to be lifted and it has to do with an organization where there could be something with a hospital something with an insurance company something someone on your telephone the utility name it whatever huge organization that you have to deal with it could be um, the people who you rent your apartment complex from it could be um, you know name it um, whoever these groups of people were that was trying to block it could be that you have a business and your business was blocked because these people but you're going to be coming out on top okay you're going to be overcoming these situation whatever the blocks whatever the situation that these people have placed for you definitely your burdens and is going to be coming you're going to be you know getting over your burdens which is very good because you're going to be realizing that whoever try to make your life um, very very hard they themselves is going to be receiving back that karma and uh, whoever did because the debt to your and it could be yourself it could be that you have done something to someone else that they created this for you and every action is a reaction so understand when things are happening remember that this reading um, um, is a hour longer and you can use the link below and access this reading going forward nurturing is one of the most important thing for you in this month it's about nurturing yourself um, it's about connecting with yourself but really nurturing yourself transition to your financial stability is definitely going to be coming through because what is transpiring what is happening is that you are making these change happening you have asked for these changes to happen and these changes are coming in and they're happening around you and this is going to be good so when we look at these energies um especially with the eye princess because you know they're all the the the, the 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 two first the second week and the third week is very emotional these are emotional things that you're going to be finding out people that was working against you and you're going to be thinking oh my god I thought that person had my back you know that sort of a thing nobody has your back okay because you have to be there for yourself because I've been realizing that people only connect with you when they need something okay no one has your back you have to be understanding this ladies and gentlemen that is all about you because people just um, are not there for you when you need them so you have to be standing for yourself you're definitely coming out of this month in a positive note because you're going to be ending um, the situation with your enemies number 61 is here that is seven you're on the right part seven again so there is going to be victorious endings um, for some of you some of you are going to be moving out of a situation some of you um, are going to be finding a resolution to a car problem some of you are definitely going to be moving so that is good the turkey spirit is here and it says give with generosity and grace give with generosity and grace so whatever you're about to do for someone in this month always give with a hope and heart okay don't give if you are just giving because you want to um, be seen that you do something give from an open heart and know that you know I want to do this for someone okay um, wonderful energy comes out for you guys this is the energy from the ascendance master and it says uh, 
the Amethyx skull. Now, this is like the skulls that you see, but they're from crystal, and they are powered up with um, certain information. So if you're a crystal child and you have one of the skull, you're going to be very vibrating at such an eye level, um, and this is going to be good. I explore the information before I uh, make a decision. So in this month, you're going to be exploring information before you make a decision, okay? During the golden era, hair, hair of Atlantis, each of the eye princess and princess, prince and princesses of the twelve tribe fashion a crystal skull, and that was an advent, advanced computer and program it with knowledge and wisdom held by their tribes. All the information was placed in the master skulls which is kept safely in the inner plane so there is 12 skull on this planet and um they have found i think like eight or nine of them it could be all 12 i have to check that out 12 and they are going to be putting them in the right place and activate this planet okay there is so much that you people are not aware of receiving this card suggests that you look for the highest perception in a situation that presents itself to you. Explore the details. When you have all the facts, take the decisive action with wisdom and integrity. So whatever you decide to do in this month, make sure you do it um, in a positive way so you make the right decision, okay? Then we have... Um, the light workers, let's see what light workers energy is coming out for. Um, the cancers, uh, ooh, the seven ray of rituals and order. The seven ray of rituals and order. So, this is wonderful because, as, as if you guys are going to be connecting with the unseen world and do your rituals to awaken your spiritual self it's going to be wonderful it's going to be good you're going to be aligning with the right situation and the right energies and you are definitely going to make in the right decision so that is good and um, what we're seeing is that you're going to be looking out for ways and means of doing positive rituals and when you do these rituals it's all about yourself it's not all about doing a ritual against someone because people need to stop that shit because you're just creating karma okay so whenever you do a ritual against someone who is not for the good of the person you are creating karma and it's going to be coming back on yourself your kids or your grandkids okay and if it's not your grandkids and you're alone and you're doing this ritual you are going to feel the parts of hell so stop doing these rituals if it's not for the good of humanity or the good of someone else let's see what other energies is coming out for the cancers we have um, foundation and achievement foundation and achievement and this is beautiful because a lot of you you can see that that this energy is breaking away moving away the people and situation that has been blocking you and as you come down you're seeing your way forward and a lot of you are going to be victorious and this is where the foundation and achievement comes in take back your power solar plex chakras take back your power some of you your power was taken away and in the month of may you're deciding hell now i'm taking back my power now to take back your power there are certain sounds that you can make that is going to activate your solar plex chakra call upon the, the yellow ray to touch open and activate your solar plex chakras call upon archangel uriel Archangel Uriel will ask, um, uh, um, awaken your solar plex chakras, and then you can say Ram, 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 R A M, Ram, 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 and that will open up your solar plex chakra. Because I'm doing it, and I'm feeling the tingling in my stomach, my feet, and. Uh, that oh, it's just R A M Ram 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 Ram, 
and you're just going to be uh, feeling so good and feeling a, such a positive energy call up on the yellow ray to flow through you and surround you call upon the energy of the Sun also your wishes and dreams are coming true oh so that's nice for you cancers I'll see your wishes and dreams are definitely coming true there is definitely going to be a celebration that is happening definitely a strong celebration you guys are going to be celebrating you have victory and success you guys are really going to be celebrating because your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true about a situation that has been happening and transpiring very wonderful energies ladies and gentlemen please remember that this reading use the link below if you'd like to see the extended of this reading and please cross watch cross plus cross watch like and share this reading i want to say to each and every person namaste until next time